This is the world's most useless kitchen invention. It's called an egg cuber. Its purpose is to take a boiled egg and compass it within its chamber using the science of compression to take a perfectly spherical egg and turn it into a permanent square. Right, we just here to explore what people used to value back in the 1970s. Yes, this is a tool from back then, a prehistoric invention used in kitchens back in the day. These first eggs have been shaped, but as you can see, I shaped them incorrectly. But I think I finally figured out how to use the machine. So I'm about to show y'all how they did it back in the 1970s. The first thing we're gonna do is boil us some eggs. I like to add vinegar to my boiling water because eggshells are mostly made of calcium carbonate, which dissolves in vinegar, and it's gonna help you to be able to peel your eggs easier later. Science and cooking go hand. Hand. The eggs that I'm making with y'all have got to come out better than the ones that I made previously. It's one thing to be a stupid invention, but it's another thing to be a stupid invention that don't work. See the wash sided eggs, I messed up because I pressed them while they were cold. The proteins are more easily to bend. They're still in a compromised state. I'm dropping my eggs in the ice bath, but I'm literally only going to leave them in there for about six minutes. Shout out to the vinegar that did this thing. Now that's an egg with no imperfections. So first we put what looks like a microscope plate down at the bottom of the teeny bopper. Then we plop the egg round side up into the contraption napper. And then you got this little kabigalaka and you put this on top and now you know what it's like to be Tia Kemp. 15 minutes in the refrigerator and we should have a perfectly square egg. <laughs> Let's taste it. Mm, the 1970s, what a time to be alive. Except it's 2020s now and they're all dead because of stupid inventions like this.